All right, real quick, man, I just want to address this Pacers loss, you know what I'm saying? Family, man, it was a much needed loss, you know what I'm saying? It was a back to reality. I'm not going to say back to reality, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't believe our winning is a fluke. I don't believe that we was winning just because we was playing under 500 teams. You feel me? I, I don't believe that because some of these under 500 teams were playing post contenders. Their record don't mean nothing. You know what I'm saying? They, they still got uh, high caliber players that we was beat. And even in all the losses, we was in the game though. So I don't believe that. You know what I mean? But it was a much needed loss in the sense that it shows these young players what they need to do in order to be able to compete against these higher caliber teams. You know what I'm saying? All this first quarter, uh, no scoring stuff ain't going to fly. You know what I'm saying? All them turnover stuff ain't going to fly. You think you're going to be able to just bounce back. You know what I mean? So this was like a, a checker right here. Like, look, <laughs> we got to clean that stuff up. You know what I mean? You got to come out in the first quarter with the mentality of we about to smack them in the mouth. You know what I'm saying? Play that first quarter like y'all play y'all fourth quarter, man. Y'all one of the best fourth quarter uh, uh, teams. You know what I mean? Even in this game, man, like, towards the end, all the way to the end of the game, man, the Pacers was dominating. But we just, I mean, we was down too much. We was down like 2017 in the first quarter, man. You know what I'm saying? That, that exerts too much energy just to come back. And then sustain it, you know what I'm saying, or, uh, or come with the lead. You know what I'm saying? Even though we erased it, you know what I'm saying, and actually had to leave for a second, we already exerted too much energy just to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, we can't play like that against these good teams. So it was a good loss for them, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I, they're going to bounce back against the, uh, the Brooklyn. For one, they already beat them. <laughs> and even the second time they played Brooklyn, they almost they should have won that game. So, and they're going to bounce back. They know what they need to do. You know what I'm saying? This court, they know what they need to do. You know what I'm saying? So it was a good loss, man. I, I appreciate the loss. You know what I mean? I knew. That they was going to lose it. I felt it in the, in, in the beginning. I felt it. You know what I'm saying? Because I felt like they just were spoiled, man. You know what I mean? They 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 haven't addressed the first quarter, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, you 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 can't allow your points to score 30 every fourth quarter. You you definitely got to <laughs> score points. So, nah, man. This is a good loss for them. We'll see how they bounce back, and they will bounce back on Friday with a win against Brooklyn. All right? Now, another situation. Miles Turner. Man, like, I don't know, man. Like, for real, like, we had the guy for eight years, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, this is the best he's played. But, like, I feel like as soon as we get him an extension, man, he's going to crack his legs. Like, he already said when he made that dunk that his knees was hurting. You know what I'm saying? Like, he can't do that every game. Why not, man? You know what I'm saying? He ain't never 26 years old. You can't dunk every game, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what you call do it every game? Jackson, you made one good dunk and then your knees hurt. So I don't know, man. Like, I, Miles Turner, he got the skills, y'all. He got it. We all know that. And he's been consistent this year. We all know that. We see it, right? But injuries, man. Injuries, man. He's too tinker talky. He's too soft. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I'm afraid of. Injuries for him. You know what I mean? Um, that in the sense that also we need, man, we need girth, man. Like, I'll be cool with keeping Turner if they address the power four situation. Like, Jaden Smith, I'm sorry, bro. You need to come off the bench. You you are not a starting power four at all. No. I don't care if you have some good games or whatever the case may be. No. We need a Miles Bridges. Something like that. You know what I'm saying? Caliber power for it like that. That's what we need. We need somebody that's big with some girth. They got some power and athleticism. You know what I'm saying? That can shoot the three. That's Miles Bridges. You know what I'm saying? Or a player like him. You know what I mean? Um, don't be commenting about Miles Bridges in my comments, man. You know what I'm saying? Get off of that. You know what I mean? My fact, y'all need to go look at the updates on this case right before y'all get to judging the man. You know what I mean? But everybody makes mistakes. But anyway, hey, we need to address the power forward situation. The power forward situation has been an issue ever since Paul George left. So, David West, 
and we haven't addressed it yet. You know what I mean? That's the Achilles right now. And I believe if we had a power for it, we would have won this game. Them boys are too big. Uh, Jalen McDaniels, man, was murky. Like, come on, man. We need we need to get a power forward, man. You know what I'm saying? We missing Chris Dorte. Chris Dorte is a better... Uh, uh, who they got in there? Uh, your boy we got from Boston, we got in there. You know what I'm saying? I like his game, but he he's not a starter. You know what I'm saying? But they keep him in there for his defense. But Chris Dorte play that defense. Any a better shooter. Any clutch. You know what I'm saying? Any a dog, too. So... We missing him, you know, man. We need him to come back, you know, if we ain't gonna start Ben. Uh, one thing about Ben, y'all, my man's defense is sketchy too. You know what I'm saying? He a rookie though, I'm gonna give him a pass. And his his demeanor during the game be a little iffy, man. Like he be nonchalantly passing the balls. Like he got a little attitude or something. I don't know, man, like, he, he be walking slow, not in the play. I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. something wrong with him. He got to add to. He don't like his role or what. But he, he need to get step out of it. I feel like Ben Matherin is playing 75% of his potential right now. You know what I'm saying? On a good day. I believe he's way better than what he's showing, man. I think it's up here, man. I think. I don't know. Because they say he's humble. I don't know. There's something about his body language, man, that's throwing me off a little bit, man. That's making me think there's something, something going on. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm not too much worried about him, though. Uh, Tyrese need to learn. Also, still need to learn when to shoot it, man. Like, dude, look to pass too much, and he be throwing. Uh, uh, when he need to shoot, he he, he pass it and get a, a freaking uh, turnover, man. Like, stop, man. Don't force the needle, man. Stop trying to thread the needle all the time and make these highlight passes, dude. Like, if it's not a clear-cut pass, you know what I'm saying, or if it's not a pass that you used to threaten, don't force it, man. Step back, pop and bust their head like you know you can, man. Or pass it back out to the dunker spot in the corner. Look for Ben, man. Everybody be playing away from Ben. Ben that's been sitting there on the island. He ain't cutting to the ball, nothing. And I know, I know they telling him to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, he just be sitting there. The best player on the team, man, just sitting there in the corner, man. And the whole play is over here. And no one, everybody's touching the ball except him. Like, what's that? I don't know, man. Like, I don't know, man. Like, what in the world? Somebody tell me what's going on with that. You know what I'm saying? This is the first game I see them trying to cut. And that's the only only reason why. Because he was the only one that will score. You know what I'm saying? Like, so... I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't like how they utilize the band because it's keeping them from getting injuries. Uh, it's getting them set up for easy shots. It's coming after the, the bench playing uh, second unit guys to make them look better. You know what I'm saying? So I'm okay with it. Keep them on. Keep them coming off the bench. It give it's, it's good for the team. And plus, you need to learn how to play defense. So yeah, that's good. You know what I'm saying? Chris Dorte come back. That's gonna help us out a lot. Man, they need to have sticks. I wish they could just trade, man. This trade. Man, get us a power forward. Please. Somebody come get us, man. PJ Washington. Somebody. Come on. Man, that's all we need is a power forward, man. Please. Hey. I still wish we had eight, man, because he's just a real thick player. And everybody talking about, look at his numbers compared. Man, he's on a whole different team, man. Dang, plus he don't want to be there. People tell me, well, if he don't want to be there and he got that type of attitude, we don't want him over here. Man, shut up. That ain't got nothing to do with it, man. You, do you want to be at your job? You know what I'm saying? Like, look, look at uh, Buddy Hill, man. He did want to be in Sacramento. He hated Sacramento. And, and he came over here, and guess what? He's a whole different player. You know what I'm saying? A whole better player, man. So stop all that, man. You know what I'm saying? Dude unhappy over there. That's why his number's like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Plus, it's not the same team, not the same culture, not the same coaches. It's a whole lot of host of things that goes into this, man, besides a player that's not wanting to be somewhere in this attitude. Y'all be, y'all be, uh, what? I don't know, man. But anyway, another team, y'all need to stop 
If you a Pacers fan, be a Pacers fan, man. Stop saying, man, you know, the uh, only reason why they win because, you know, they, they, they. shut up, man. Look, man, let me get out of here because there's a whole lot I got to say, but I ain't about to say it, man. But, you know what I'm saying? Good loss, Pacers, you know what I'm saying? We're going to get back at it, you know what I'm saying, on Friday. You know what I mean? It's going to be good. And, and, and that's it, man. I'll let you.